Hi folks, Puffin here with your Antifa News Brief for October 12th, 2021. October 11th, 12th. Um, President Joe Biden still has 101 days left in his first year in office to arrest Donald Trump. Shouldn't take all 101 days, but doing a countdown for the last days of President Biden's first year in office, because hopefully he'll have Trump arrested in his first year in office. Now, I've been doing something with a theme for each day. So today is 101. It's actually now in America, it's October 12th all over America. So, except for maybe Hawaii. But, hi Hawaii. But, um, until noon, it's still the 264th day of Joe Biden's presidency. 264th day since Trump left office that he still hasn't gone to jail. And, you know, we need to make that transition because he's still threatening democracy, he's still threatening the country. And Joe Biden's primary job is to protect the country from enemies, foreign and domestic. Trump represents a foreign and domestic enemy. He's a domestic enemy. He's a domestic terrorist here on our soil. But he's also a foreign enemy, you know, under the sway of Putin. He's a Putin puppet. So he's a foreign and domestic enemy. And, you know, both of the things Joe Biden's supposed to protect us against. Sworn by the Constitution protect us against. Now, maybe there's some hang-ups. Maybe there's some details that need to be worked out. It doesn't really feel like he's about to be arrested. But I did want to point out, it's the middle of the night right now, and Trump could be arrested in the middle of the night. It doesn't have to be in the daytime or during, you know, the regular news hours. It could be the middle of the night that Trump is arrested. He could be arrested by now, we just haven't heard it yet. Or it's been a secret. But, you know, I'm expecting him to stop talking and stop showing up at rallies once he's been arrested. So, looking forward to it. And then since this is the 101 episode, I wanted to mention a couple things. 101, of course, makes me, uh, reminds me of 101 Dalmatians and enjoying the Cruella movie where they rehabilitated or made a sympathetic character of the origin stories of who becomes a villain. It makes you think maybe someday they could make some type of sympathetic movie about young Trump and whatever he went through to turn him into the evil monster that he became. Or maybe he could have some type of story arc where he repents and becomes good again. I don't think so. The way he's lately demonizing people from Haiti, refugees from Haiti, like he just can't get enough demonizing people. One problem is, though, Joe Biden hasn't reversed his policies enough to welcome the refugees from Haiti in. Joe Biden has apparently not reversed his policies enough to stop the trade war with China. You basically want to do the opposite of every single thing Trump did because he exemplified everything evil and wrong about America. And one thing you want to do the opposite of is letting him walk around free. So, you know, go ahead and lock him up. The 101 side of that also reminds me of, like, an introductory class. Like, you need the basics. So the basics for 101 are, yeah, stop the guy who's trying to overthrow the country. That's a good reason to arrest somebody. But some other reasons to arrest Trump, and that's, you know, the Trump surrection, January 6th, and prior to that, trying to, you know, invalidate the election or say you know, the only way he wouldn't win the election is if it's rigged. And then, of course, continuing that afterwards. But aside from all that, or even if he hadn't got to that point, we wanted him arrested before that just for, you know, destroying democracy in various ways. Um, it's a lot. The Trump virus, spreading the Trump virus, was a terrible thing. Also, just still in the very last year. But there was plenty we could have arrested him for before that, like trying to, you know, take fascism and racism and entrench it further in our society. It's already entrenched and infested in our society. But to entrench it further in our society to, you know, make irreversible changes types of things, such as Supreme Court picks. But, uh, a lot of the stuff he did, just very anti-American and all according to Putin's playbook. But the genocide of the Trump virus, lying about it, spreading it, trying to keep people from wearing masks, trying to push people back to work, everything he did. Um, and you got to go, you know, completely the opposite of it. But you have 101 days left to, um, to fix that mistake, to, um, to address... It and keep it from getting worse. That's the other thing. You're doing Trump a favor. He's safer in jail because a lot of his supporters are the most, you know, craziest, violent, terroristic people in America, and they might turn against Trump. And 
he would be safer locked away somewhere than just running around free if one of them realizes all the lies he's told him or sees through it or has family members die from the Trump virus and wants some type of revenge on Trump. He's safer in jail. And we're all safer with him in jail. I've been using the hashtag safer in jail. Um, we're all safer with him in jail because then the whole revolt thing, revolution thing crumbles and they stop doing it. Otherwise, they're going to keep doing it. And they're going to keep terrorizing people along the way. So we've got to stop it. We've got to shut it down. It's just basic. That's why I'm saying it's 101. We don't want to go through 100 more days of Trump running around. We need to go ahead and start fixing problems in America and the world. And we can't do that with these Nazi fascists obstructing us in the way and killing people and just threatening the whole system all the time, keeping people in a, in a state of fear and panic and um, distress. Also, we just got to go against everything they've done. You know, if he's for, you know, war and confrontation with China, let's be friends with China. Let's not have war. Let's have peace and cooperation throughout the world. And then we can save the world and save ourselves. So 101 days to go. Let's lock up Trump sooner than that so we can stop the